Known for being a fashion capital of the world, Milan is a fantastic place to visit in Italy. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share the things to know before you visit Milan. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So firstly, let's look at the best time to visit Milan. The best time to visit is from April to May or September to October, when the weather is pleasant and there are less crowds. Italy sees a lot of visitors from June to August, so avoid at this time if possible. You could visit in the off-season between November and March, but the weather isn't the best at this time. Expect some foggy and rainy days. Christmas is a good time to visit Milan if you want to visit the Christmas markets and enjoy some shopping over the holiday season. So now let's look at getting there. Many visitors will fly into Milan from other European cities. There are plenty of low-cost airlines that offer direct flights to one of the three international airports that are based around Milan. If you are traveling from the US, there are non-stop flights available from Chicago, LA, Boston and Houston, but these can vary in price, so book in advance. If you have time to really explore Italy, then taking the train is a great option. Italy has a fantastic train network. Milan is just two hours away from Venice and three hours away from Rome. So now let's look at getting around Milan. The best way to get around Milan is by using the public transport system named the ATM. This system includes subways, buses and trams and is an affordable and easy option to use in the city. You can also use taxis in the city but the prices can be much more expensive especially if you get caught in traffic. However, there are often taxi stands outside the more popular attractions, so these make for great options if you are short on time. So now let's look at the typical prices. Milan has plenty of hostels available for visitors with basic dorm beds starting at 25 euros. Budget hotel rooms in the city centre start at around 80 but can be as much as 150 in the summer months. When it comes to four and five star hotels, prices massively vary but expect to pay at least 300 euros. You can pick up a cheap breakfast for under 3 euros and lunches from vendors or local bakeries will cost around 5 euros. You can find dinner for around 15 if you head to the cheaper pizza spots further away from the attractions or enjoy a sit-down Italian meal for around 25 euros per person. Public transport here is pretty cheap with one journey tickets costing around 1 euro 40 and 24 hour passes available for under 5 euros. Italy is always going to be more expensive than visiting some of the cheaper destinations in Europe but in Milan there are plenty of ways that you can save some money. Firstly, save money by staying in a hostel. Milan is home to plenty of hostels to choose from and you can opt for a private room in a hostel to save money but still get some privacy. When booking flights, compare the prices of the three different airports. Ryanair and Wizz Air offer some fantastic deals but you really need to compare them. If you plan on using the public transport a lot, you can get a 10 pack of tickets and it allows you to save money on all forms of public transport. There are plenty of affordable restaurants in Milan too, so do your research before your trip, but also take advantage of the public parks during the warmer months. Picking up food from a grocery store or bakery and enjoying a meal in the park is always a cheap and nice option. You can also enjoy the free attractions such as the Duomo di Milano and and the monumental cemetery but also check out the free walking tours available in the city too so now let's look at the best things to do in milan milan has plenty of gorgeous sights and fun attractions on offer Duomo di Milano is the iconic Gothic cathedral that Milan is known for, whilst the Castello Sforzesco is an incredible fortress that makes for a unique place to visit and is home to plenty of art treasures. 
Galleria Vittorio Emmanuel II is the place to go for high-end shopping, and those that love Italian art should head to Pinacoteca di Brera. Visit Santa Maria del Grezi to see the iconic masterpiece, The Last Supper. But also make sure to head to San Siro Stadium to check out one of the Milan football teams. Watch this video to find out the best places to visit in Italy. Then, to visit the nearby city of Venice, watch this video. We hope you have an incredible time in Milan. Stay safe and stay creative.